and welcome back to the hangar. Um, that last mission sucked. Uh, it's probably one of my least favorite in the game. We made it through though, and now we are clear, free and clear to go off and have more adventures. I've been thinking now about what I want to go do, and let's check our map here. I think what I am looking at, we okay. First of all, we do have way down here bow and arrow, which is obviously a Heroes of the Inner Sphere. I know that that one is trying to give us a mech, a nice archer. That archer might be really fun in Solaris with like as an um, SRM boat, like to just get in the face of. So I'm not putting that one out yet. But as I'm looking around here, you know, everywhere we have, we have all types of, you know, um, higher uh, reward missions and things like that. We also... We have a little campaign over here. It would be fun, no matter what, to just go after those in need with the hatchet men. Um, so I think what we want to do is just start knocking these these fun missions out everywhere that we find them. How about that? So one other thing I noticed right as I was getting going, I've seen it all. we have Captain Atwood here, who's a 43. I'm going to purchase that person. Hands are wasted money. And we are going to get commander. rid of. Oh, this guy is a 21 to 23, but still, of 23 to max out, I think it is time to dismiss you. And anything else drastic? We have some 40s. Lieutenant Coles there. I don't know, you're doing okay for us, though, at the moment. So we're going to leave Coles in there. Um, oh, you know, we can get rid of Lugo. And there was one more 40 here. Meet you in the ready room. I will be. You're ready to start. I will be waiting in the ready room. Meet you in the. I will yeah, we'll go with Guzman. Skills are at your disposal. Guzman. All right. And on that note, um, I think we're getting repaired here now. We still have our little javelin sitting there. We ended up picking up an atlas now. I feel like we're building our lance. I want to have a whole bunch of. Um, I want to have a full three tiers. You know. Um, 12 mechs that are just like constantly rotating and badass so that we can do all these campaigns and maybe have a few in cold storage we got that dragon in there we should maybe sell him at some point because i don't want to invest the money we'll think about that later so um i'm gonna start up top strength of tradition it's a two but you know let's just knock it out let's just have fun again this is um i record these in batches this is my second day off in a row, so I get to just like hang out. I got a haircut, and now all I'm doing today is recording. I made it work, so I'm ready to play as much of this game as I possibly can. So, Lagam Gumi. Greetings from the Lagam Gumi, or Lagom. You may be surprised to hear from a Yakuza organization from Rasselhagian planets, but I assure you we can be found on nearly every system the Draconis Combine once controlled. Now before you rashly reject our offer, pay no heed to those who would paint us as criminals. Regardless of our organization's dealings, all y Yakuza, Gumi, share a deep cultural tradition. Our ultimate loyalty lies with our local community. When calamity strikes, we are foremost among those who provide aid and disaster relief to the people we and our leadership have sworn to protect. Perhaps knowing our true aims will help you decide to work with us. Our listeners in nearby systems have heard rumors of impending pirate attacks near the periphery. We have attempted to pass these rumors off to official military channels so that something can be done to forestall them. But this region of space goes largely ignored in favor of hotter conflict regions. In the interest of preventing disaster before it can strike our community, the Oyabun of the Lagom Gumi seeks to hire you to defend the planets under our protection. As I'm reading this too, I'm thinking, even though this is a low reputation, we are getting in with Curita a little bit, so we're going to get more negotiation points. I think it's nice that we're being a little diverse here. Um, House Davian and House Merrick are the two that don't like us right now, but that's fine. We're going to accept it. Um, let's see here. And are we already somewhere where we can go? We have a defense, and then we have a demolition there. Um, we'll, we'll go for the defense. Let's take it. By the way, we are definitely going to try to get into it with um, some of these mercenary companies. That's another reason for doing this. So, all right. Let's contracts. 15 defense, of course. 160 tonnage limit. That's fine. It's going to be me and maybe one other dude. Um, you know, we're going to... Oh, let's go for salvage because we might still be able to pick up a mech of some kind. 
and a little money. Heavy weather warning is in effect, Commander. Your visibility and sensor readings will be compromised out there. You know what's interesting, though, is maybe, maybe, maybe... Oh, no, I want to have my one good guy. I'm going with my Marauder. Can't help it. I was thinking of going with uh, the Hunchback. But, um... In that case, though, we are going to go with our Hunchback for our second. That's 125. You know what? Little Javelin? Let's. We're going to stay under. We're just going to go. Javelin, you, you proved yourself. And you're looking badass, so... Um... Although I could strip out those jump jets, but we're going to leave it. Who do we want to, like, build up now? We have 42s, right? 48. Captain Adams, you're in now. How are we doing? We have McLean there. Did, oh, we had Shen, Shen Zhang. We're going to put you in the, uh, the javelin because you like to get beat up. Actually, um, we're going to switch. There we go. He's been my number two. We're going to make sure he doesn't get beat too hard. Let's go. Again, thank you for being here. I love playing this game. We're building up to um, the road to Solaris. Solaris actually at this time comes out in like three we days. We need to move fast, Commander. The pirate band known so. as the Werewolf Legion are bearing down on a nearby settlement. The residents have gone into lockdown, but tens of thousands of innocent lives are still on the line. It's up to you to protect them. This may be a small enough place where I'm not going to like post stuff. Sometimes I'll set um, my mechs at different corners for defenses. We can't thank you enough for coming to our aid, Commander. We have a visual on you. Looks like we made it here Fun. just in time, Commander. I don't want to be standing still, but... Hostile forces just crossed the perimeter, Commander. They're heading your way. Where are we at? There we go. Target acquired. Commander, enemy forces Guys, go get are that javelin. Close for comfort for my people. Chase them down and keep them away from us. Oh my god, I got him. Looks like you've got their attention. I'm showing multiple hostiles incoming on your position. Target acquired. Lead them. Oh man. New target javelin. We'll just go get into it. And I'm waking up with coffee, so if my voice goes gruff and I have to cough a couple times, Target I apologize. Oh my god, I'm, that's because I'm over here. Just settle down. There, it only Target wasted a million. Another Griffin. By the way, my upgraded um, auto cannon. Oh, I, I shot high. You know, you guys come after this guy. <clears throat> We're gonna finish him. Additional bogies heading along a trajectory that intersects with your position. Yeah, you're not going to do well here. Oh, I need to get better at aiming my PPCs. <clears throat> okay. I like when they swear. I don't swear a lot on the channel, but that doesn't mean I'm opposed to it. Oh my god. I'm having fun with this. This is great. Can I randomly get one? You guys go after that Shadowhawk. I'm going to try to not destroy too much of the city as I stomp through it. These streets are narrow, though, man. Let's
There we go. Shadowhawk almost destroyed. That little locust. Get out of here. Come take these guys out. There's one. And two. It's a fun little warm-up. Where are you? Right there. There you are. Missile platform. I mean, the war dog, if we were to do those, it would just be getting us, like, overall reputation, I think. A little bit heavier. I'm detecting no more Werewolf Legion troops. Oh, that's it. It seems as though casualties sustained were kept to a minimum. Yeah, they were. Good job. High five. Wait, no, I'm... I was a little too far away to hit him, right? That's a high five. Blow him up, do a headshot accidentally. All right, we'll see... I, you know, we can plan things out, but I think we're going to get some little surprises in this one. 18, so we at least, we pick that up. Why not? Machine guns, extra medium lasers, LRMs. Oh my God, Captain Adams got injured in the javelin. Well, I'm glad we did that. The hunchback. Only damage you got was probably from me punching you, huh? Okay, so... Let's cold storage you. That was totally worth it. Let's just repair. Double heat sink. Did I punch and make him lose a double heat sink? That's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Eventually, we're going to get somewhere where we can find... Oh, I have 114... Why am I buying? 114 heat sinks, that's right. Okay, so... We're just going to go, 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 go. And then something eventually is going to interrupt us. I think we're going to kick over and do that hatchet, man, anyway. Just because it's fun. We're here for fun. A bunch of these um, kind of DLC missions too, I did as DLC, I just jumped straight into them. So it's fun to do them as in context of a long um, playthrough. So, Oh, Eyes on De Democracy, the Conspirators. That's, that's a, that'll be a fun one, won't it? Uh, I'm Sylvan Vaughn, a representative of the Eyes on Democracy. We're an independent watchdog group that monitors local level democratic elections within the Federated Sons. We have received dire intel that the leading candidate in the regional election for a trade federation presidency position, one Casper Owens, has been targeted in an assassination plot by the Lord of the Capellan March, Duke Hasek Davian. Our sources say the candid that candidate Owens and Duke Hasek Davian have had a number of public spats, with Casper Owens openly denouncing Duke Hasek Davian's rule over the Capellan March. It appears as if the Duke wishes to see candidate Owens dead so that his puppet candidate may secure the election. Eyes on democracy cannot allow for this to happen. While the Federated Sons' interstellar politics are often dominated by hereditary rulers that serve at the beck and call to their house lords, how various systems are administered is often left to the discretion of the Duke or Duchess of each system. Because of this, a large number of system-level administrative positions in the Federation are often filed through elected representatives from the local populace. With this trade federation presidency serving as a sensitive position that administers jump shipping routes, commercial dropship cargo processing, and logistical distribution of supplies from multiple systems around the Capellan March. Eyes on Democracy cannot allow for such a sensitive public position to erode into a puppet of our regional March Lord. It is unlikely that Duke Hasek Davian would allow for that power to return to the people once he secures it. 
We would like to contract your mercenary outfit to reinforce our security detail around Casper Owens and assist us in protecting the integrity of this regional election. While we have a small contingent of battle mech forces on hand, we cannot hope to stand against the might that Duke Hasek Davian can bring if this intelligence ends up being true. The voices of these free people of the Federated Sons needs your expertise. Commander, will you help us? We will consider it. And also, <clears throat> by the way, I think it's good to read all these things as we go. Oh, there's a marauder. I might want another marauder. That makes me want to do this one. Hello, mercenary. Living out in the Torian Concordant, we've learned to sleep with one eye open. The threat of a Davian invasion is always looming overhead, and we've spotted a potential shark in the waters. The planet of Sirton, Sirton was recently raided by what appeared to be a Davian scouting party coming from the Montour system. Protector Calderon sees this as a clear sign that Hans Davian has already begun infiltrating our nation in an attempt to cordon the entire Concordant. The Protector wants to ready the entire nation for war and initiate a preemptive counter-invasion, but high-ranking officials in the Torian Defense Force want to handle this incident in a more level-headed way. We would like to enlist your services to investigate this raiding party and destroy those responsible for the raid on Sirton. Your first mission is to confirm that these raiders truly were affiliated with the Federated Sons. We want you to travel to the Montour system and provoke the local defenders into attacking you. We will monitor their unit compositions and see if they have any marks that would affiliate them with the raiders that attacked Syreton. Provided that you help us track down these those responsible for the... I can't say this word right. Syreton raids, we're prepared to offer you a heavy mecha's payment for the group's utter destruction. Good luck, we're counting on you. I mean... I can always take a extra one. That's cool. And that feels like that's a lead up to the Legend of the Kestrel Lancers. Um, yeah, I feel like we're not going to be able to do everything in this game, if that makes sense. Like, we're going to have to pick and prioritize over time. Um, but right now we're doing this. By the way, check, check equipment, see if there's anything we want to pick up. Mech market, anything just sitting there. Contracts, Demolition 15, we're at our 160 limit. Demolition, you know, I'm I'm going to still stick with what we have. We're going salvage mostly. Heavy weather warning is in effect, Commander. Your visibility will be compromised out there. I'm going to change pilots because we do not want to wait. Actually, why, why do I even want to invest in McLean? I don't. 42, 20, let's go with... Guzman. Let's hit it. I think reading all the, the literature also like seeps us like in the culture of the game a little bit more. Some of you might play this game and not be readers. You know, some people really are, so I think it's still useful for me to read it. We know what's happening. We're kind of more immersed other than just jumping from mission to mission to mission. We are a mercenary unit though, so our loyalty is to the job, or is supposed to be. We're going on the offensive today, boss. The Breedung warriors have been terrorizing this region for years now, and it's up to us to finally put a stop to them. I've marked their stronghold on your battle grid. Go forth and raise it to the ground. Can we raise it before we even get there? I could almost use some more AC5 ammo. I feel like I use it a lot, but, you know, I think we, we have enough. Get in with those PPCs. It's just, it's probably my favorite weapon on this thing. Even, you know, dual PPCs, you would think, uh... see where we're at when we get close here. Our target is now marked. Go get him. We're at 
blew that arm off right away? Nope. There we did. There we go. I'm just gonna let my boys take care of some business here, I feel like. We're gonna crash through some walls. Take this wall out. You guys take out all these things. And we'll go back to some shooting. You've managed to demolish about half of the target's buildings. Yeah, yeah. Garrison Commander does not seem happy. What? Oh, something's sending some rounds at me. You guys, get that light scorpion tank. This is fun. If we had burst fire, it'd be like, da 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 go crazy. Another turret over here somewhere. Destroy that turret. Threat eliminated. Let's get out of here. We did our job. Ooh, that was a nice one. You know what? Did did we really do our job well enough? There's still civilians that need to you know. <laughs> I know there was somebody on one of the forums that's like, oh, I can't do that mission. I, I draw the line in video games that, you know, attacking civilians. It's like, come on, come on. Makes me immediately think of Rampage as a kid on the Nintendo. It's like, man, all we did was pick up civilians and eat them. What about that? Out of windows? Bathtubs? What are you hitting over here? Are they still trying to throw some destruction in? Okay, well, I feel like we made it. We survived. Alright, I think that's enough destruction for one day. You've dealt a catastrophic blow to the pirates. Hell yeah. Bye bye, pirates. That was fun, though. I just like destroying. That was cool. Seeing the walls come crumbling down. My goal today is to record as many episodes as I can and get us moved forward. Again, at least we picked up a mech. That's 1.5 million. That's that's where it's at. Very good. All right, some SRM six. Is that a level here? Where's level two? Fine. Good. I'll take it. Uh, never let it be said that your command lacks honor, Commander. Sure, we just destroyed a pirate haven. You have done our people and the Log Lagam Gumi a valuable service. If you do not wish to risk your reputation by admitting having openly attacked, worked with the Yakuza, then list Middle Way LTD on your resume. Middle Way, huh? Anyone searching for that organization will reach us and we will gladly extol your virtues. Go with peace and honor. Maybe cross paths again if the universe wills it. It's it's quite possible. All right, so let's just cold storage. Um, repair, 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 and where are we headed now? So this is a two to three charity case. You know that's that's a little too. Um, we got a bunch of stuff to do. You know what? I think we go for this. Just because it's going to be fun. Let's just knock it out quick. We're just like rolling dice. We'll just... 
kind of random up. What do we have for a transmission, though? Yeah, a dragon in sheep's clothing. Didn't we already... No, it's a different one. So, field communication, Omega security for your eyes only. The International Security Force, the Draconis Combine's intelligence service, have been monitoring secret meetings between the great houses of Steiner and Davian. While we are unsure of the full nature of these meetings, we cannot allow any formal alliance to solidify between our two border enemies. Should you choose to accept it, your first mission is to spoil relations between these two houses by raiding a Steiner outpost while masquerading as a House Davian detachment. You know, fun stuff, but I don't need the dragon. But, I mean, we, we accept everything. We just put it on the board. So, uh, let's go to... Is there anything interesting here? Champion, 60 tonner. Nah. Jenner, I just love Jenners. I don't need it, though. Um... We have equipment. Anything special floating around? Heavy arena fist, huh? Yeah, maybe eventually we'll get into some of this stuff, especially with when we go into uh, Solaris, but I'd rather have, like, SRMs and just be, like, pounding people with them. Supercharged. I'm looking for uh, double heat sinks more than anything else, right? So let's go to contracts. Those in need, we've learned that a lance of the Arcturan Guards is often sent to a garrison in a number of small installations close to their primary base of operations. While we don't know the exact, and this is for independence, okay, know the exact garrison rotation of the lance, you will be able to find them at one of the marked locations. Destroy each and every one of the main targets and we will swoop in to salvage them. We'll take our salvage and our money and know that this isn't a very heavy payout. Oh, we're going to go with the same people we have here. And lovely. I'm looking at our bank account, though, and right now our 400 something thousand dollars every so often, we need to make sure we're making money and not just... we got to make wise decisions here, maybe. Attention. Prepare for battle -like but I can't pass this up. Let's go just obliterate some hatchet. Then. Doors Stand clear. Look around, check everything. Online. The independent people of Sky want us to eliminate a lance of hatchet men suspected to be on patrol at one of the marked nav points. Be sure to approach each one with caution, Commander. While the hatchet man's signature hatchet is devastating up close, it's more than capable of splitting a mech in two after a handful of blows. That's close enough. Ready to start pickup operation. You can never have too much ammunition. Oh, it's ammo? What do we get? Okay. Some more AC5 ammo? Who knows? Just go. Um, I was just... In my head, I was thinking about two... When I was a kid, I grew up with, like, early video games and stuff, and some of the simulations were my favorite, you know, from flight simulators to, um... Uh... What is it? Submarine stuff, you know? Like, really, really fun. And I feel like this is kind of the best of both worlds. It's like, so there's a nostalgia about this. I also love games where you can ha either have, like, your own like home. And this is kind of like that because we're building our own thing, our own story, our own name, mercenary company. I feel like it's personalized. It's just one of my favorite things. Let's just toast this fool. I need to. I mean, I suppose it's okay that my heat goes critical. I just got to time out my um. Boom goes the dynamite. The blown up. Where's our next one? No, I'm gonna cut through. We're gonna go. We're gonna not do the boring wrap around. Oh shit! Where are you? Splash target. Target acquired. Get in there. Last target identified. Target destroyed. try to cruise through this, you know, quick as possible, but 
How pretty is this? And these scripted missions kind of, you know, they're going to be in pretty places. They're going to have great music. We'll sip our coffee as we're going through. Oh, we might have to. Hmm. Can we check it from here? There we go. Showing all targets at this location, oh, we found it then. Approach with caution. Must, should I stumble my ass down? I can. Now my other guys though might not do it. Oh, I hurt my legs a little bit. Target acquired. That's good. Try to get some perspective. These trees are gonna want them to like just sneak up on us, aren't they? Coming for me, bro. Target acquired. They're all here. If all three of them end up on me and just start hatcheting at me, I am dead, right? Get that one. Trying to soften them up. There's a ton of them. Enemy I got one coming for me on my side. I'm trying to take this guy's arm off. There we go. Go for the ones with the arms still. That was fun. Now let's that was get fun. you all home. Head to the evac point. Feel like they were trying to swarm us. Oh. Those aren't friendlies. Enemy spotted. Is there some? Oh. Get the VTOL. Who is, who is up here hitting me? Little, little flying bastards. Alright. Let's bug out. Hunchback was getting into it. Might have gotten hit a couple times with a hatchet. And we out. Although we're not making friends with Steiner, are we? Is that who's we're playing with? Who's we are? Yeah. That's okay. We're level nine. I'm I'm digging that for right now. We're getting closer to expert. Oh, we picked up another mech. I'll take it. That assassin at the end there did it. And another transmission. Oh yeah, those in need part two. Good work, Commander. We're able 
to recover all four of the hatchmen that your lance destroyed, but their battle damage is significant. In order to get them operational, we need to collect a large supply of replacement parts. We've identified a series of locations where the Arcturan guards have stored replacement actuators, myomer bundles, and weapon systems for the hatchetmen. We need to conduct an objective raid to find and recover these supplies in order to repair the lance of hatchetmen you captured for us. We'll highlight locations in which the supplies should be located, but it will be up to you and your lance to identify and recover any materials on site. All further tactical information has been forwarded over to Rihanna. Rihanna? Yeah. Good hunting, Commander. Let's do it. Let's, uh, cold storage. A little collection there to sell off when we get to it. Um, a repair. Repair. Anything? Is this still here? Sure. Again, go salvage and money. Take us 16 days to get repaired for it. That's okay. I just look forward. I just love building this lance. Like, I'm thinking we don't have, like, our best mechs yet by any stretch. Let's go. I heard the glitch about launching here is, like, a common thing. There's a way maybe you leave your mech, go out, do this. I just save it and the then reload IPS it. The may help their salvage hatchetmen, but they currently don't have the means to repair and refit them. Their intelligence has highlighted potential locations for various supplies needed to repair and maintain the Octuran Guard's hatchetmen. Our mission here is a straight-up smash and grab to rob them of these supplies. We'll move on the facilities marked on your hood. Collect our clients' needed components, and then get out of there before the rest of the Arcturan guards can respond. Be careful, Commander. Although we took out a full lance of them, the Arcturan guards reportedly still have two more lances worth of hatchetmen active in their roster. Be sure to approach each facility with caution, as those mechs can do serious damage up close. I love Enemy these damaged cities. Manticore heavy tank. To pick it up. I don't. I don't need more ballistics. Target is down. Thank you. Is that that manticore? Is that thing will mess us up, just shooting us from behind the whole time. Oh, beautiful music. Let's get a perspective here. Target acquired. Oh, we already have one getting hurt, huh? Target acquired. You coming up on us, huh, bro? Oh, you're a little guy. My god. We need to get these turrets down. Trying to hack me. Okay. Kill that fool. Here we go. Okay, you're toast. Okay. There's a lot going on. But I also think we're seeing a lot at once, aren't we? Maybe. I don't know. Pretty intense for a level three, uh, reputation three mission. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target acquired. Target destroyed. Hey, where are you? 
Oh, searching. I see. You have to be inside the target for a period of time. You guys, go kill that thing. There we are. You heard the commander. Take that target. Target eliminated. Yes, Shenzhen. Okay, guys. You with me? Feel like. We're gonna get surprised here. They're gonna be like right up on us. Target acquired. Target destroyed. Component lost. Can't take this much damage much longer. Oh my god, where? What are you talking about? Oh, headshot. Finish him. Come on. Okay, we're the actuators. Over here, got it. Glad. <laughs> this is fun that this is harder than what I was expecting, actually. Oh, we're going. What is this? Yeah, we need to... Okay, let's go for this final one. Yes, and... Oh, right out of the sky. Blow some walls off. Oh my god. Son of a bitch. Gotta do some perimeter runs and then whittle these things down, man. I mean, we can hit and run too, but. Let's target engaged. And search from outside this wall too. Oh, you bastard! <laughs> Lance attack confirmed. Tango down. I'm gonna stand here and search. go get it, and then maybe we run away, because uh, Javelin not doing that great. Peekaboo. Where is it? Where are your Myomer bundles?
hatchet men coming. Mobile units on radar. Mobile units. Target. Once you've found the targeted asset, move up to it, and we'll begin the recovery procedure. Got it. Clients needed supplies. Time to pull out before the rest of the Arcturan guards converge on our yeah, position. We're coming. Get a move on it, Ooh. Commander. You know what? I think we're gonna go right through them. What do you guys think? New target. Copy, Commander. Blunt's targets confirmed. Uh, I think. Oh, almost. You guys get the spider. Blue leg off almost. How's that little guy doing? One more good pop. Oh. You guys finish him then. To watch them on radar, they can take it. All right, we're out of here. That was fun. That was fun. Good music. Is there another one? There might be another mission for this series here. We'll see. Or is that it? We got the parts. Pancho likes it. Did we get another mech for our collection? Nope. Uh, but a PPC AC-10s. Actually, actually, I want those medium lasers. Anything else special? One machine gun, maybe. All right, excellent work. That's it. We got our medium hatchet and our hatchet man. Um, not only were you able to acquire surplus supplies in excess of what we initially estimated, but you've also eliminated more of the Arcturian Guard hatchetmen for us to salvage. With this sur surplus, my superiors have authorized me to provide you with our first refurbished hatchetman as a bonus for your exemplary performance. You'll need it in your next assignment. Blah, blah, blah. What is our next assignment? Uh, the independent people of Sky have come to learn that Tobias Klein is stationed here on Benfeld, Benfled with the Arcturian Guards. Tobias is the eldest son of Emma Klein, who sits on the Defiance Industries Board of Directors. We believe that Tobias's current situation station may be the reason Defiance and the Archon have shown such clear favoritism towards the Arcturian Guards. We're tasking your lance with finding Tobias and his catapult and destroying it. Even if Tobias survives the encounter, the destruction of his family's mech should show to his mother that the Arcturian Guards are undeserving of such preferential treatment. I want that catapult, but that's probably not going to happen. We need to repair up. Anybody actually get injured? Not really. Alright. Again, it's not going to give us a catapult, but we'll go. We've made enough money that we're feeling good about it. Let's repair... Some fun little lance, though. See, the thing is, once you go into the very high, high, high missions, we're just going to be running with, like, super heavy mechs all the time, which is going to be fun, but it's kind of cool to have this little bit of variety going. And, you know, I just noticed that we are 10 shy, so let's go with a different mech here. Um, well, I mean, we could do the hatchet man, but I don't want to. <laughs> uh, let's go... What do we have here? SRM's AC-5 or light rifle. We'll go the AC-5. Now we're over. Damn it. Um, well, you know, let's 
What do we do here? Now we're 20 under. Now we're 10 over. We're gonna go 10 over. Let's go. Just me and an Atlas with Shen Zhang. Just me and my buddy. Tobias Klein, son of Defiance Industries board member Emma Klein, has been discovered to be serving with the Octuran Guards. The independent people of Sky believe that Tobias's current assignment to the Guards is one of the primary reasons why Defiance has shown such favoritism towards supplying the unit. They want him and his family's catapult taken out as a way to send a message to Defiance's board of directors. Search for Tobias and his catapult at the Martin up points, then prepare for extraction once he's been eliminated. This catapult is going to be able to just like shoot down one of these corridors straight at us. I have to try to stay away from that. What the hell is this? That's oh, a big rock formation. Looked like a, a pile of poo. Yeah, we'll do this to start. Oh. Target acquired. Okay. Target Locust. Okay. Gauntlet, fighting against our forces. Moving to strike. Oh, move, move, move. I got a head hit because I'm not moving. Looks like we got some bad intel. Our target is not here. Let's hope we have better look at the other locations. Let's see if I can just, like, march forward. Yeah, let's keep walking past them. Target identified, Commander. Put them down. Where? Target ID received. Moving in. Target acquired. Target identified. Put them down. It's kind of ominous. New target blackjack. There he is. Get him. Salvage him anyway. Oh, he's gonna flame me. Target is down. You're out. Confirmed. Now let's get you all home. Head to the I'm gonna eat back. My leg isn't feeling good. Tobias has been taken out. Mission complete. Now, get back to the OZ and we'll get you out of here. We don't have enough salvage to make it worth it. Oh my god. It came slamming right into my head, dude. New target assessed. I feel like Shen Zhang is back Priority there just messing it up. Received. Finish that cicada, he pissed me off. It was actually the assassin. Running in trying to assassinate him. Alright, alright. Oh, it'd be nice if they gave us that catapult. I don't think they are. And I think that Hatchet Man would probably want to put in cold storage if I'm going to use it. I'll debate if we have enough money, I'll just keep a lot of mechs in cold storage. Yep. We are close there. Getting a blackjack, but yeah, I'm just gonna go up this way. That's fine. Go under one. 
I'm still just at 37 of 60 for my skills, so we can get better. Oh, is there another one? Your performance up to this point has been exemplary, but we fear that your efficiency might make our objectives here too transparent to the outside observer. This could potentially lead to the Arcturan guards identifying our organization, which is something we cannot risk. For our own safety, we need you to throw the guards off our trail by attacking a military target, making the entire endeavor appear more as a clandestine military raid. We've identified a remote outpost that contains the Arcturan guards' backup data center. Destroying this facility won't be enough to compromise Ben Fled's security, but should be enough for our actions here to appear that our objectives here were the dis were the destruction of his data center and not the systematic strikes against the Arcturan guards themselves. I mean, that makes sense, right? I am not going to underestimate this mission, though, because I feel like they've been tough with us. Not tough, but harder than I would think for a uh, for a level 20 or, you know, difficulty level 20. Heavy weather warning is in effect, Commander. Your visibility and sensor readings will be compromised out there. You know, I think we go back to what we got here. I've enjoyed the javelin, but that's too heavy. We're 10 under. Yeah, we're, let's do it. Let's do 10 under and get all, all our stuff for this. Um, who do we have going? Who's our potential? Let's go with Clayton. I can handle it. We need... I think we're speeding and... Are we... Is this a destruction mission? Or a raid? I don't know. Stand clear. At this point, it looks like a destruction. Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. In an to cover our tracks, looks the beautiful. IPS want us to destroy a remote Arcturan Guards outpost containing the battalion's data servers. IPS Intel claims that given its remote location, the outpost does not typically station a heavy complement of defenders. Typically. But the guard will surely deploy additional defenses should the base come under attack. It's best if we aim to destroy our objective and leave before the guards can intercept us. Oh, we'll try. Commander. Enemy forces closing in fast. Guys, hit that spider. Fire on target. Target acquired. Shay. New target, commander. Our target is now marked. Go get him. Gauntlet base has confirmed the visual of hostile mercenary force. Yeah, I'm gonna get in here and just uh get some destruction on. Or we underestimate these moves. I want them to go after that trebuchet. Destroy. Welcome, focusing fire. Enemy 
There we go. We got there. Get that little spider. We're half. They're gonna start sending in some more crew here. The area is down to half capacity. Keep going. Can't hit me higher. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Get out of here so they're not like right on top of me. Let's let my boys do their nope. Big boo. This guy's off the side shooting me. There we go. Just a wee bit more, Commander. This complex is on the verge of collapse. Ammo low. Ammo low indeed. Enemies have sapped our fuel reserves. Let's see. Target applied. I haven't taken any damage. I'm doing well. You did it, there we go. This whole place has been flattened. Now, let's get out of here before more trouble arrives. Head to the evac zone. Oh my god. Hit my own boy. <laughs> Let's just get out of here. They are getting pretty beat up in there. Jenner, huh? Okay, well, I feel like we made it through this. That's it, Commander. I've confirmed with the IPS that we have satisfied the terms of our contract on this mission. Now let's get out of here before the Octuran guards come in force. He did have to bail at the end there. The spider. Anything good? At least we're done. Um, oh, we're one away. <laughs> That's okay. We'll just go up this way. Just take stuff we can sell later. Alright, alright. Everybody looking good. Yeah, the most damage was with Shen Zhang with that, uh... Oh, we have some fun weapons. That's what we get here. Okay. Great work, Commander. In addition to destroying the Arcturan Guard's data center, we've discovered that the guards appear to have been using their stockpiled hatchetmen to experiment with refitting a number of their other mechs with similar melee weapons. While it appears that these alternative melee weapons are nothing more than cosmetic knockoffs of the hatchet technology developed by Defiance, they seem to have different offensive profiles when compared to the standard hatchet. As a performance bonus, we'll provide you with a few samples of the weapons we salvaged from the facility. These weapons appear to be compatible with hatchetmen we provided, so we hope that you can put them to good use. That's, that's fun. I love the medium claw. What do we have here? Oh, there's another one? Okay, well, in that case, uh, before we release you from your contract, we have one final assignment for you. We want to give the Arcturan guards one final gesture of up yours before we return home. My people have put in anonymous tips through the local law enforcement reporting Kiritan mechs held up in what is known locally as the Heap. Once upon a time it was a Star League era metropolis, but warships obliterated it through orbital bombardments during the early succession wars. In the hundreds of years since, the city ruins had become a massive dumping ground, dumping ground for all of Ben Fled's waste. Everything from the trash of the major population centers to industrial waste disposal. It all ends up here among the ruins of the old world. After handing them a pair of embarrassing defeats, the Arcturan Guard will be forced to investigate this tip, which means they will be conveniently suckered into a spot where it should be easy enough for you to pick them apart. We'll leave these spoiled jackasses buried in Ben Fled's trash, right where they all belong. 
Afterwards, we'll release the remainder of your contract payments, and then we'll go our separate ways. And, I mean, we get a, a mech for it. That'll be money. Let's heal up. Did we lose anything? We did not. You know what, though? Put this hatchet. We're sitting here like it's money. Let's um, move it to cold storage. Now we're sitting on $7 million. That's not bad. We're doing better. We're doing better. Let's make sure there's not any equipment just sitting here, though. Sometimes maybe they're leaving us in a place that would hook us up. Not uh, really. Same mechs. Okay. Let's do it. Contract. Uh, restricted Scrap Tempest. This will be a fun place. Now, okay, so for all of this, House Steiner, is it maybe because we're, like, disguised? We're only minus 16 with them. I don't feel like that's too crazy. Extreme right. weather warning is in effect, Commander. You'll have limited visibility out there and have to contend with sensor malfunctions. Now we're the 10 under, you know, I feel like... Let's... Let's go a little crazy here. Let's just do it. I don't care. We're going to go heavy on this one. I just want to cruise through this. We know we get an assassin for it. Finish this off. We haven't had our Warhammer out with us for a while. Online. Would be fun to rename all our books, Bob and Fred. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Oh, classic. Your current guards have been leaked false intel that our primary base of operations is in the dumping ground, known to locals as the Heap. Our client wants to send a message by destroying whatever scouting party the Obturan Guards has deployed, leaving them to rot here in this massive junkyard. I advise that you watch your back out there, Commander. What the 19th Obturan Guards lack in experience, they make up four in sheer numbers, including all of their remaining hatchet men that mm. remain unaccounted for. Clear the field, and then we can be on our way. Good hunting. Should be toast in like two seconds, yep. Blow his arm off yet. I was more afraid of that Irby. Feel like slow, steady movement, but they're gonna be coming at us. What? Oh, I was like, oh, legs. You guys finish him. Black Tango eliminated. Damn. This is a fun environment though. Dropping more off over there. Let's come around this way, guys. Heavy metal on radar. Heavy metal on radar. Target acquired. Shifting to your target, Commander. Trying to aim on this side. Take away his primary weapon. Hey. Something wrong, huh? What happened? I feel like let's come up this way.
the lightning. Where? Oh, back behind us. Oh, you bastard. They're gonna try to surround us. We had something over here, though. Try not to walk too fast. Kind of keep a pacing here. Oh. Spin around. Oh, what? What? View here. Walk slow. New target. We have target received. Target acquired. Oh, Thunderbolt. Let's you guys take the Thunderbolt. Engaged. I'm gonna finish this guy. So why don't we just all one. I couldn't get my uh, my gun aim down any further because it's on my head. as we start going up in the ranks. Uh, yeah, 12. Ooh. We actually could get that. That's awesome. Even an over tonnage penalty. Wait. Oh, 8. I'm an ass. Oh, we could have gotten it. Eh, okay. That's fine. That's fine. Hatchets, sure. We got the assassin, though. Commander, we can't thank you enough for giving the Patriots of Sky the means to defend our own borders. You've done more to support our people than our own head of state. While Archon Steiner squanders her time placating the Commonwealth's oligarchs and getting in bed with foreign Davian pigs and warmongers, the people of Sky suffer under the relentless, relentless raids of House Curita. Thanks to your efforts, we now stand a chance at standing up to these foreign hordes and maybe one day freeing ourselves from this ridiculous Fedcom alliance the Archon has forced upon us. We find ourselves needing your services again. We won't hesitate to call claim. Let's just see. By the way, for fun. Wait, so here we go. Tons of jump jets. A medium claw. I see. So running up and just like slashing people. We're going to put you into cold storage. And then I think it is time for us to pop out. What do we have going on here? Dragon in sheep's clothing? Sure, sure. Um... What do we have? That was a hero's. That's a dragon in sheep's clothing. We have a whole bunch of stuff here. Which way? Let's look at our operations just for a minute. Um, 
bow and arrow, hazing the weak, the conspirators. All these are reasonable, you know, heroes of the inner sphere stuff. I feel like this, getting this marauder might be a great thing to do. Um, where is it? It is way down here. But you know what? We might want to do that for fun. Let's, um, let's have a little adventure. How close can we, how many jumps to get to the inner sphere? 600, so we can't do that. We're gonna heal up here. 76 days elapsed. I wanna go get this other marauder. Unless something stops us from doing it. Oh shit. Unless something stops us from doing it. Priority mission, Operation Galahad. Commander, I'm Colonel Arden Sortek of the Armed Forces of the Federated Sons. I'm reaching out on behalf of First Prince Hans Davian with a lucrative offer for you and your mercenary company. As I'm sure you've already heard, the Federated Sons have joined an alliance with the Lyrian Commonwealth that will eventually merge us into a single nation. The Federated Commonwealth. The eventual unification of two very different great houses has come with its fair share of skepticism and issues to work through, especially when it comes to the military where the AFFS and the LCAF have for centuries had two very different ways of approaching war. First, Prince Hans Davin strongly believes that it is in our best interest to work out as many of these issues as possible prior our unification. To address this, we will be hosting a series of war games across multiple Davian words, worlds in what will be called Operation Galahad. The Federated Sons would like to contract you and your mercenary company later this year to participate in these war games. We are offering generous compensation along with the possibilities of future long-term contracts should your performance meet our expectations. Please let us know soon if you would like to accept your contract. Accepting this offer so will cede travel and mission control to your employer for one week. Okay. Oh, well, I accepted, sure. Um, is that not... Oh, oh my god, I accepted. <laughs> well, let's repair up. I, I screwed up then. That's fine. I should have waited to accept it, but I'm just used to accepting everything and just going for it. Well, you know what? I feel like we're good. Um, Let's do one more fun thing here. Let's change our paint scheme. Now I had this one. Let's um change our primary. Okay, so I applied all. We want kind of with an orange. I'm keeping the the bones because I think that's kind of a fun one. Um, yeah, I guess we're in it now. Uh, Legends of the Kestrel Lancer. We're getting ready to go. We have six million. We have a good lance to start with, and I think we're gonna come out of it with a bunch of money and be able to be prepared for whatever comes our way. We also have a bunch sitting in cold storage that we're ready to go, so I love it. Let's um, let's just let our guys get repaired. Let's head out. Let's go to war. We have a new paint job, and let's do it all in the next episode.